Hello, I'm McLean Goodwin. After fighting a good fight, I've proven I just don't know when to quit. Even after losing the past four political elections, five recounts, and one very misfortunate shot and incident, I'm not done yet. For years, having good health and being able to get proper medical treatment was the right of the wealthy. Now us hard-working Americans have to wait in line with them. Now the hospitals are full of sick poor people. What gives? Because of this new freedom of free health care, poor people just live to be poor longer. But what about us, good, hard-working Americans? What do we get out of this? McLean Goodman's Republican bargaining campaign is the cure. For years, we've seen the liberals get their way. Now, that's not very fair. What I'm politely suggesting is that maybe we should ease up on this change stuff. If the liberals are getting free health care, I think it's only fair to us good hard-working Americans get something in return, like spouse abuse. Back in the day, when my great-grandmother wouldn't listen, my great-grandfather would let her know who the boss was. This fond tradition was passed down from my grandfather to my father. And then by the time it was going to be my tradition, they said it was bad. Now folks, I'm not saying you should just go hit women. That's just wrong, and it should be a crime. What I'm just saying is, if it is your wife, well, it is your wife. The real question is, if all these hospitals are going to be full of sick poor people, then what's the big deal about a few more bumps and bruises? If you're not going to let us hard-working Americans knock out health care, then let us hit our wives. I'm McLean Goodman, and I approve this message. Paid for by the Campaign of Republican Bargaining.